Hey everybody, it's your boy Alex here and we are back with vlog number four. I'm in the comfort of my own room right now, shout out my skateboard. Um, today's vlog is going to be about how Big Tobacco, Big Nicotine, Big Vape, all these companies target youth groups, uh, minority groups, African American, Asian American. But today, specifically, I want to focus on how Big Tobacco has targeted women throughout the ages. But before we get started, I want to show you something really cool that I just got. Um, let's go to my car real quick. Yes, uh, sir. Look at my car. I just realized that my car seat covers match my jacket. Yes, sir. Anyways, let's get started in the video. Like I said, it's going to be about focusing on how Big Tobacco has been targeting women throughout the ages. And let, I'm going to show off by showing you guys two quick pictures, okay? To keep a slender figure, no one can deny. Reach for a lucky instead of a sweet. This is Big Tobacco targeting women for their insecurities and diets. This was made in 1920. Now this one was made around 2015, 2016, a jewel advertisement. Now this one may not say anything on it, but it's Big Tobacco trying to advertise a product that looks really slim, really cool, and has a really cool looking woman on it. If you were a teenager that was addicted to nicotine and saw this poster, you would think it was the coolest thing in the world. Big Tobacco have done this type of marketing forever. And throughout all my years of tobacco prevention, I have always seen this like in every presentation. I think it is so crazy that, you know, even though they were doing this back in the 60s and 70s, they're still doing it now. And, you know, it's 2022, it's the new year, and they're probably still making ideas to target people like women, African Americans, Asian Americans. And I could back that up by showing you guys a lot more proof. Uh, I'll throw in a couple more pictures to show you guys how um, Big Tobacco has just been doing this for so long. Here is another advertisement, Bold, Cold, Newport, an African American couple looking all cool, smoking their cigarettes. This is used to target the African American culture and try and get more people in this culture to buy their products, which is bad. Here is another one. This one says, find your voice with an Asian American lady on it saying, you know, if you use these products, you'll find your voice. Like, nah, bro, use these products, you're probably going to lose your voice type B. You know what I mean? So Big Tobacco has been doing this forever. So what I want you guys to do is to leave a comment, message us, just let us know. Have you ever seen any type of advertising or marketing from Big Tobacco that maybe you felt like was targeting a certain group? Now, you may be wondering, Alex, how am I going to leave a comment? How do you want me to message you? Well, follow us on at TX Say What on every social media. Hey, you, why aren't you following us on Instagram yet? Or Snapchat or Twitter or Facebook? Make sure you guys are following us because we're going to be posting a lot about these action summits coming up. And I really hope to see you there because these things are going to go crazy. Guys, we're going to five, five in-person summits this year coming up really soon. So follow us on social media. So whenever we post, whenever registration comes out, you guys can be the first ones to register. And I really hope to see you there. Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate you guys staying till the end. I know it was a lot of information, but it's really, really good information that most people don't know about. Um, thank you guys so much for watching one more time. And uh, my name is Alan Velapaz. I'll see you in the next one.